Salutation Sentinels. Welcome back to another Ark of War video. My name is Natsu and I have decided to make yet another video and this one is a bit of a doozy. In my lifetime I have seen millions and billions of the reward token events and have rarely ever completed the task of getting 800 points and thus being able to collect all the prizes from this event. Now I know what you may be thinking Saying there on the other side of the screen, judging me for being the way that I am. Ooh, Natsu, why are you so lazy? It's not that hard. Ooh, Natsu, just get good at the game. You'll never be like Melt. Okay, okay, stop it. Stop you hooligans. That's all besides the point. In this video, I'm going to see if I'm able to complete the reward token event in 24 hours. And I am sorry if I sound extra nasally today because I have pollen allergies and it's not fun it's not fun i tell you all right enjoy the video the first thing i did was pop a few benadryl to help with my allergies and then i fast traveled to my inventory to see if i had enough energy sodas because in order to get 800 points in the event you're going to need this many wins and to get this that many wins you're going to need to spend this many energy sodas now just take that number and add another 50 sodas because my pure stubbornness to give up even though i may get 30 defeat reports on the same person I went to Ace of Galaxies, looked for my trusty Hancock, threw my best sweet gear on him because as you all know, no one uses Shadow for some apparent reason, and then proceeded to use my trusty box troops because I get no greater pleasure than hearing someone tell me I'm not good because I have box troops and not to talk to them because I am weak, but I'm not forcing them to reply to me. <laughs> Jokers. And thus begins my 24-hour conquest through the gauntlet called Ace of Galaxies, where I first decided to fight people at 3 times speed, easily slaughtering all who fall before me, then realizing that 3 times speed wasn't going to be enough. I decided to bump up the speed, where you may receive a flashing light warning at a whopping 5 times speed of that of a normal human being. And you may be wondering how I could possibly do this. Well, the power of editing, my friend. And after about what feels like two hours of fighting for me in only a span of a minute and a half for you, I decided to check my current progress. To my astonishment, I didn't make it very far. Coming to terms with the frightening climb of another 700 fights I must go through, I decided to bump the speed up to that of Koro Sensei, mashing the button repeatedly at 10 times speed, that I ended up imploding like the useless black hole bonds that this game offers. As I continue my way through the gauntlet, I just want you guys to know that if you somehow at this speed see your name being beaten by me, I just want you to know it's okay. It's okay that you did not use resistance to weaken effect gear because it just makes my life a whole lot easier. There were some points where I kept trying to beat people into submission until I finally realized it was just as futile as when Iron Man tried to beat Thanos into submission to protect the time stone. Then, as I tried to press the refresh button to continue on to my next set of victims, my internet crashed, as it likes to do, forcing me to refresh my game, and when I came back to Ace of Galaxies, the timer had restarted to 10 minutes, and the same enemies from before the refresh are still there. Thank you, God, for ruining my life. My refresh ended, and I was back to killing everyone who supports small business, much like government officials when slapping heavy regulations and higher taxes. And then, the unthinkable happened. An update happened, wasting another 10 minutes of my time only to find out that seven pirates create furry eye candy as their next commander. At this point in my life, I started to question, why are we here? Just to suffer. As I have done the same exact thing for the past four hours, with 10 minute breaks in between, my mental state started to deteriorate by this point. I had resorted to my good friend Suntory Whiskey, took a few shots before I thought to myself, it might have been a bad idea to be drinking alcohol while I'm taking antibiotic medication for my ear infection. But that didn't stop me from attempting to teach my liver a lesson. After making a few more people wish they never knew me, I decided to take a look at how many points I had left. I had less than 100 people left to be up for the lunch money, and with new vigor, I saw furiously pressing the challenge button, even faster as I knew I was finally nearing the, my end goal. After a few unbearable clicks later, as I started to realize my fingers had calluses, I finally did it. I got 800 points. I hastily claimed all my rewards and finished this mind-numbing task. And in answer to your question, 
Did I finish it in 24 hours like I set out to do? The answer is no. I finished after four days because unlike popular opinion, I have a job and real life things I have to take care of. You know, wife, kids, pets, you name it. However, if you count the amount of time I actually put into doing this, I would say it took about 12 hours of actual effort. And if you guys like this video, please, please give me a like and subscribe. Okay, this, this, this is too much for me to bear. My liver is hurting. My liver is begging you. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what, I don't know where I was going with this, but see ya.